Thanks for stopping by on such short notice. Have a soda. Mm. <laughs> Any excuse to visit Sweet Susie Soda Pop is a good excuse to me. Mm. Last night's storm did a number on this giant soda. It sure did. I'm just glad the wind didn't knock it off completely. Well, don't you worry, sweet Susie. I'll get this soda standing upright again in no time. Now, I keep forgetting, is it righty loosey, lefty tidy? Whoops! <laughs> other way! Other way! Uh, sweet Susie, can I ask you a question? Sure, Barry. What is it? Did you fill the giant soda cup with actual soda pop? Well, of course. It wouldn't be a sweet Susie soda pop if I didn't. What would the customers think? <laughs> well, I'll get this soda sorted out. Then I'm going to have to get over to Carl's Car Wash. I had some sort of car wash washer, I'd be able to reach this twig. <laughs> Speaking of washing, I know there was a storm last night, but I thought it was just wind. What kind of storm were you in, Barry? <laughs> if I told you, you wouldn't believe me, Carl. Can you clean me up? Sure thing, Barry. Let's get started. What kind of vehicle are you driving? Is the vehicle a bus, a bucket truck, or a digger? That's it. It's a bucket truck. Now, let's see how messy this bucket truck is. Is it a little messy? Medium messy or super duper messy? Hmm, it looks like only half of it is messy. So I'd say it's medium messy. Now, let's see what kind of mess this is. Hmm, it's sweet and sticky. Is it sweet sticky soda pop, refreshing orange juice, or black coffee? It's certainly sweet sticky soda pop. And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized or is it big? That is one big bucket truck. Twenty-three tokens, Barry. I've been practicing my counting, so I'll pay by sevens. Seven. Fourteen. Twenty-one. Plus two equals twenty-three.
Now I can get back to town. There's still a bunch of places that need fixing after that storm. If you ever need help reaching high up places, give me a call. Will do, Barry. Oops! Oh, oh, when did that get up there? Oh, Barry! Come 